Did anybody ever give you a free fishing lure? Good morning, guys and girls. Let's look at our catch of the day for March the 3rd. Our scripture is going to be out of the book of John, John 11, 26. Everyone who lives and believes in me shall never die. Everyone who lives and believes in me shall never die. Obviously, that is Jesus speaking. That's the red letters in the Bible right there. Everyone who lives and believes in me shall never die. Our devotional says the first time I remember anything being given to me because of my fishing happened in the late 1960s in a tournament on Sam Rayburn Lake. That's down in Texas. John Fox of the old American Angler television show gave me a handful of twister worms. Not in a package, just a handful of twister worms. Now, those of y'all that have been with us for a little while know that uh, recently I just attended John Fox's 90th birthday party. <laughs> That's right, 90th birthday party. And I think I actually sometime on that video, y'all need to kind of go back and look at that video about John's 90th birthday party because it's amazing. This guy, 90 years old, and he sang karaoke until after midnight. It's about 12.30 or 1 o'clock before that party had broken up. And I had flown down there that day after working uh, at the O'Reilly uh, Auto Parts Leadership Conference until about noon and then flew to Florida. And, and but it was a great party. It was a great party. But John came up to me uh, after that tournament was over. He was fishing the tournament, so I guess he didn't want to give them to me that I could use in the tournament against him and gave me a handful of twi twister worms. Mr. Twister Worm. Very first time I got anything free because of my fishing or my fishing ability. Uh, what else we got to say about that? These are the first plastic worms with a curly tail. Mr. Twister, a curly tail. I caught a lot of fish on those worms and so did all of my buddies. I told everyone how great they were and a lot of my friends, I'd give them like one worm. Go try this worm, go try this worm. You can't believe how it looks in the water. God has given us the greatest gifts that we could ever receive. Eternal life, and listen to this, eternal life and a joy and a hope for everyday living that can never fade away. Eternal life plus and a joy and a hope for everyday living that can never fade away. No matter what you're going through right now, this is what God gives you, a joy and a hope for every day that can never fade away. Yet so many of us Christians don't share this gift with our buddies. Today, share with a friend what God is doing in your life. What a great tip that will be that you can give them. You know, I speak at about 15 to 25 churches a year, and when people find that out, a lot of them are surprised. Maybe I'm not living as godly a life as I should. They're surprised that I'm out speaking at churches. But I think people just think that I fish all the time, and I don't get to fish very often. I'm getting ready to go today, getting ready to go today. But, uh, but, but they say, what do you talk about when you go to a church? What do you talk about? And that's exactly what I talk about. I talk about what God is doing in my life. You don't have to pound them or beat them over the head of the Bible. You don't have to know a lot of scripture. Just share with your buddies, your friends, what God is doing in your life. And that'll be a great tip for them. Our tip for today is a spin tail bait like a little George works great in rivers for all species. Now a little George is a little lead bait that's got a little end on the end of it. It's got a little tiny spinner that spins. And uh, you can throw it a mile, you can just crank it in and it'll catch fish. You can drop it all the way down to the bottom, jigging it straight up and down. It is a great bait for this time of the year when the white bass get up the rivers. It'll catch all species. It'll catch bass, catch crappie, it'll catch catfish, it'll catch white bass, it'll catch stripers. But that's a great bait to use in the rivers when those white bass get up in the river. Because you can throw it out there, drop it down in holes, you can really, really catch a lot of fish on it. So that's absolutely a great bait to use this time of the year. Okay, guys and girls, go out there and have you a great one. It's going to be a great day here because I'm going fishing. I hope you are too. Hey, I love you. It's going to be a great day for, for us. I'm just absolutely positive that I'm going to make it a great day. Hey, girls and guys, I love you.